Hey, today I'm playing Super Cute Cavern. And I have audio off because if I put audio on, you can barely hear me. But, um, uh, if you want, you can go watch other people who actually have good microphones play the game. So you can actually hear the audio because it's actually a really, because it actually has really good audio. Oh, there's a monkey getting a haircut. Whatever. Thank you to my friend DKJM for helping me get the um obsidian boots. I replaced them with my I replaced my spring boots with the obsidian boots because the obsidian boots are better because you can walk in lava and speed up. Okay, I'm just checking the shop. Okay. So basically, you should all play Super Cute Cavern. It's an extremely good game. I'll just show you a level real quick. Basically, in the game, there's like, um, stuff. There's basically like, it's kind of like Minecraft in a certain way. Like, you can craft things, there's levels, there's enemies, there's bosses. The game is awesome. And if and you guys know like that Super Mario 64 inspired game called Robot 64? Yeah, the same guy who made that made this. Uh thank you again, thank you to my friend DK for helping me a lot in this game and in even introducing me to the game itself. And he helped me a lot to get as good as I am in the game. Because I'm like extremely good and DK helped me get super good i have like an extra and i have like an extremely good weapon called the axe and i have a ray gun which is pretty cool let me just show you how overpowered the axe is normally you have to hit this guy on his button but nope just him with the axe he's done for not even has to be on his button yeah i usually use the ray gun for the bosses uh Every in every world, red blue. So far, the game is still in development. It's not finished yet, but it's pretty nice so far. So basically, in every world, there's three randomly generated levels, and uh, after the three is a boss, and then when you win the boss, it drops a bunch of random items. And, like there's enemies throughout the level, and they all drop random items. Like, I'll show you real quick. Like, there's like a pretty rare thing called a strange gizmo. And to make it, you get a cart. Actually, DK, okay, again, DK helped me because he gave me his own cart. And then he got another cart. But the cart is overpowered. It's basically extremely fast. Like, really fast. And I just spawned right next to the spawn. I'm just gonna grab this key. Real quick. That, oh. Now I have to kill an enemy to get a heart, my heart back. Let me see what I get from killing these. The witch. Hey. At least I got a key, I guess. That's so okay. Hey, I already, I only lost half a heart. Well, this is the last world, so. This is gonna be the boss. But this one is kind of difficult, but it's extremely easy if you have the ray gun. It's, yeah. You have to hit it five times because the ray gun does two damage. I'm just gonna get the gift real quick and see it. Whoa, got a Santa hat. That's pretty cool, but I don't really want it. I like my wizard hat better. Wait, let me just see how it looks on me real quick. Yeah, I don't think it looks that good. So I'm just gonna equip my wizard hat again because I like it better. But there's basically when you fight a boss or there's a kind of roach and it drops from a witch. You got super magic, and you can, like, use... And two rocks make boots. And if you have super magic, you can get super boots, which is basically just boots with speed. And I don't know how to craft spring boots, but it's okay. If you... Just get 40 coins, and you can get them in the shop. And they're, like, extremely common. 